guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's going to be another YouTube video and for today's video, I'm gonna share how I edit my thumbnails. So, first things first, so sabihin ko sa inyo kung ano yung mga equipment na ginagamit ko. So this one is my brother's iPad and his Apple Pencil. Ginagamit ko to for animation, doodles, even on my YouTube videos na may animation, ito yung ginagamit ko. Ang hirap lang talaga ako sa M-Broke as well. So, isha-share ko na yung mga ginagamit kong apps, yung mga favorite brushes ko dun sa app na ginagamit ko para mamaya ipapakita ko na lang on how I edit them. Yeah. Let's start with the app that I use. I use PixArt or sometimes Photoshop para makrap ko yung photo into 1 to 80 by 720 pixels which yun yung size ng thumbnail sa YouTube. And then, the second app that I use is Adobe Fresco. Yeah, Adobe Fresco. So, Adobe Fresco, madami din mga pang doodle sa App Store, pero Adobe Fresco yung gusto ko. Ewan ko kung meron siya sa Android, pero if wala, madami naman like auto sketchbook, something like that. Pero nasanay lang ako sa Adobe Fresco, pero I think it's the same features and brushes, so I'm not sure, but I think so. Okay, some additional na ginagamit ko na app is Adobe Lightroom for the settings like contrast, brightness, grains. Okay, so yung unang favorite brush ko is yung hard round, which is something like this. Second favorite brush ko is rough pencil, something like this. Yung third is gritty, which is something like this. Uh, yung sunod naman na favorite brush ko is chunk, which is something like this. And the third is the small chisel, which is something like this. So, yun yung mga favorite brushes ko dun sa Adobe Fresco na app. And for the color palette, I usually search for boho theme, nude palette, retro palette, and pastel palette. Okay, so that's the usually the color palette that I use. Sa so, Safari ko lang siya sinesearch and i-add ko sa photos and i-add ko dun sa Adobe Fresco. And I'm just gonna use the color picker, you know what I'm saying? If you don't... I will show it to you later on. If you guys are looking for something like doodly thumbnails, may mga favorite YouTubers ako which are Hannah Bangilina, Nidan Feliz, Best Dress, and Kiara Gan. They're so artistic and creative and, you know, super effort mag-edit ng videos. Hindi ko kagaya. <gasps> okay, on the next clip, papakita ko na kung paano ko ina-edit or kung paano ako nagdududa sa thumbnail. Pero, I'm not that good for making tutorial videos so papakita ko na lang kung paano and kung voice over ako ng a little bit papakita ko na how I edit my thumbnails in 3, 2, 1 Hey guys, I'm back with the voiceover, so I'm just gonna click the custom size and I'm gonna type 1 to 80 by 720 I'm just gonna zoom out and I'm gonna click the photos and i-add ko yung picture na nakrap ko na sa PixArt. I'm just gonna click the photo ulit para i-add naman yung color palette na gagamitin ko. So, I'm just gonna add a new layer para magkaroon ng doodly text. I'm just gonna click the sketching and pipiliin ko yung favorite brush ko na small chisel. Pili lang ako ng right size. Minsan malaki, minsan, ayan, kagaya niyan, malaki. So, liliitan ko. And yung smoothing, I make sure that it's 100 para mas smooth yung paglalettering. I'm just gonna dual lettering. Tapos, pipili lang ako ng iba-ibang color para mas colorful na yung tama pa rin sa color palette. So, I'm just gonna write paint with me because ito yung video na aesthetic na nagpaint ako sa canvas. Ayan, pili lang ako ng color na gusto ko na bagay na sa tingin ko bagay. So, to use a color picker, you're just gonna hold the photo para ma ma-pick nyo yung color. Yan, tada! Okay na. Iusod ko lang siya kasi hindi siya nakagitna. Okay, 
So, pipili naman ako iba ng brush. Yun yung hard round. And, I'm just gonna pick color white para magkaroon ako ng outline. So, yan. Gagawa ko ng outline. I will go to Lightroom so I could make some adjustment dun sa photo. Minimal lang naman. Well, I'm just gonna edit the exposure, the contrast, highlights. Ayan, parang medyo aesthetic lang. I'm just gonna negative the contrast, contrast. For today's video, I hope you learned something and enjoyed this video as much as I did. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. It means a lot more than you know, and don't forget, life's too short not to be as yourself. We got this girl. See you in the next one. Bye.